You know, probably one of my most underrated games from 2019 was Remnant from the Ashes. It's a game I played a lot. Uh, even after I finished it, I just kept grinding. I like gear type games. As you can see, my gear score was not that high. 16. I think like 20 was the max at the time. I'm not sure if it's expanded now, but uh, welcome back. Perfect World wanted to sponsor a video. If you want to know more about the new DLC that's now available uh, for $10 on an Xbox One and PS4, it's just as you're seeing this video, it just went live on those two platforms. Uh, just click the link. It should be at the very, very top of the description. I'm playing on PC, so it's been available for a little bit longer on here. Um, but the bundle for everything is like $35 uh, if you want to get the DLC in the main game. I'm going to kind of go over how to access the new area, show off some of the new sections, and uh, yeah, just kind of get back into this game. I love the game originally when I played it. I like the drop-in, drop-out matchmaking and everything, so I'm going to give it a shot. You guys are awesome. Best audience ever. Hope to see this do well. If it does do well, I'll probably do more, but I just wanted to kind of do one video for now. Kind of check it out. All right, guys, I love you. Let's get this. So I'm going to show you how to access the new DLC and kind of go over each thing that they've added since I last played. Uh, world settings, obviously, was already in the game, but you can also... I'll show you how to access everything. Survival mode? I haven't checked this out. What is this? An endless experience with... Okay. Boss experience recommended. Oh, wow. So if you don't know how to fight the different bosses... Oh, that actually sounds kind of nice. Uh, world settings? Here's kind of what I'm doing. You can reroll the campaign like originally... Uh, but what we're going to do here is go to adventure mode. Survival mode is also in this column as well. You go to create new adventure. Of course, this is the uh, the area where like the swamps and everything. So that's where I'm going to go for this DLC uh, in this video. So we have this area. I guess it's kind of like a starting point. Or you can go back to Earth. Yeah. Let's go here. Let's check it out. Uh, normal. Let's do that. <laughs> so what happens here? I guess it's just now, now active. And then we're good. Oh, you know what? I haven't been in the shops and stuff in a while in this game. Look at all the different things I have. Actually, I haven't looked at anything in a while. Okay, let me see. They might have changed some of the stuff. Here was the outfit, the three-piece assassin. 30% uh, damage. Reloading increases the total damage dealt. Okay, yeah, I remember that. Mo oh, Mender's Charm. Let's see. Dragon Hearts. Kill allies. Okay. Let me see what else I can do. Maybe they've changed some of these. That actually sounds really good. Uh, a lot to take in there. Increases max stamina 25%. Increases... Oh, yeah. Oh, this is one of my favorite weapons in the game. Let me see if I can upgrade anything. I don't know what all is, like... Upgradable? Right here? Let's see. Ah, good to see you again. Uh, let's ah, see some of this. Let's... I might have a way I can... Okay, hold on. Let's see if there's anything different. Beam rifle. Now, wait a minute. Hardened iron. Okay, I need to... <laughs> need to actually have more of that. Yo, so you can essentially upgrade pretty much anything you have the coach. Gotta remember that. That was actually what I started with for the longest time. Uh, Alright, buy items. Anything here? No? So okay. So, it's essentially the same kind of setup. Alright, let's go ahead and get this. So, I got it on public. So that means people can just randomly join me. I don't know how this is going to go, though. I might get maxed out. I don't know. Alright, world settings to reroll the current campaign. I got that. Uh, let's go ahead and travel to the swamp, man. Let's get it! They've apparently added a bunch of different types of things, like the, uh... Survival in hard mode, nightmare mode, all that stuff. Oh, this isn't looking good. Yo, I'm kinda nervous right now. He's down. Oh, I used- man, I used to love this game's, like, just the combat. The loot system, it's just kind of refreshing. I don't think I've ever played a game like it. Definitely one of the games that I really enjoyed last year more than... More than most people, I feel like. <clears throat> what if I should try to summon some people here? Oh dear, hold on. Let me just back up. A little bit rusty. Let's see if it does anything. <laughs> I haven't done that in a while. Nice. Oh god. Oh god. Let's heal up really quick. I love how responsive it's, it always has been. Well, essentially the way this game, I don't know if you guys ever played it, but the way it works is you have these two abilities you have on your guns. Like right now I got the healing one. If I get to a certain point, uh, as I kill things, the little circle on the bottom right hand corner for the gun will fill up. I wonder if I should just go back and try to just get people to join me. 
I feel like it'd be a lot more fun that way. I might do that. These enemies will respawn because of me doing this. It's kind of like the Dark Souls-esque way where things come come back. Let me see. Uh, I should have it. I should have people can actually join. Let me make sure. Uh, yeah, it's a public session. Okay, maybe just I'll get lucky and somebody will hop up here in a minute. The way it works is if somebody joins you, you then have to wait. Yeah, like when somebody just joined. So I have to actually go back to the grind now. Whatever this is considered. Two people joined. Maybe I just had to go touch it one time. I don't know. Here we go. Here we go, baby. They got apparently some new armor skins as well. I didn't know about. Oh, wait. This is always one of my favorite abilities. All right, here we go. There's apparently a new zone in this area, too. Oh, they still got the animation. Look how many health blocks that person has. Oh, my goodness. That's the hills they have. So, they have 10? I only have 8. Interesting. Oh, look at the outfits. I'm missing out on some of this stuff, man. Need to be careful. Hey, big point, let's go. I never was a fan of the melee build. I prefer the range, you know? Get that corrosion, hold on. Should I go back there and get something? Like, it's amazing how the, uh, how smooth the game is when people jump in here, you know? So you still get scrap from these areas. I'm gonna try to get to like a boss in this. I don't know if it'll be like a new boss or what, because this is an area you can actually access. It just got some new, new portions to it. This person's build is kind of nuts, honestly. I don't know what they're doing. It's like there's so much this difference since last time I played it. All right, I think we're good. Galvanized iron, that's actually... That was one of the higher-end things you needed. I, I guess it's just available now. I'm playing on normal if you play on higher difficulties like Nightmare and all that, which I was tempted to, but my first time going back to this, I would rather not get maxed out, so... Let's see the map. We got a little while to go. Uh-oh, hold on. You can hop through, can't you? Okay, you can. Nice. I was about to say, I was like, I remember you being able to hop through stuff. Can I hop down and not take damage? Here we go. Just a little bit. Just a little bit. I can do. I can use this as well. It's like a, over time you get health back. A lot of these items I use because I remember I would after I beat the game originally I helped out other people do the same thing. Just going back and helping uh, people finish. Like the last boss fight originally wasn't that bad. I was able to solo it. Uh, but then after a while they changed it to where it's actually a lot harder now. Unless they've changed it again. Oh, hold on, I want to hit them. There he is, friendly fire, so you got to be careful. Long gun ammo. Nice. Pretty straightforward. I like how if other people kill stuff as well, you, you get the XP. And, you know, It's not like you got to fight to get XP in this game. What is this? That was rough. 400 scrap. That's a lot. Yo, I'm actually... I You know, I might... Uh, <laughs> I kind of want to see what all this thing has to offer. Like, I, I wouldn't mind exploring it more. I'll kind of see how the video does if you guys would like more. Uh, I don't know if it's got, like, a new thing that you need to get to first or what. Because this is kind of a, a part that was already in the game, but they've expanded upon it. And it's got, like, some new, new modes and new everything, pretty much. Alright, so we're all just, like, standing around. 
<laughs> I'm gonna take the initiative and just run run down here. It looks like there's an open area. There's a lot of new areas in this section. Let's see what's down here. You kinda have to just take take charge, just take this. Oh yeah, whatever gun that is they got. Look at that thing. That's some DLC, we'll see. One thing about this game I, I used to admire a lot was, I've, and I've never seen it done before, was the option to reroll the campaign after you beat the game. Or just in the middle, if you're like, you know what, I don't like the way these uh, these sections are going, I want to change it up. And some bosses you could only get, they were like kind of rare, you know? But I think they've kind of changed that up a little bit. I remember there was like certain guns you could only get if you did like, you got to certain areas and you knew like how to do a puzzle and stuff. I got carried a lot. <laughs> I was just there hanging out. Oh yeah. I'm getting low on ammo though. I might switch. They got the ability now. What this basically does, this ability I currently have, is if I die, I'm pretty sure I come I come back to life like immediately. I'll just kind of hang on to it. For a bit. This is just the healing proc. Yo, what is that thing that's throwing? Kinda new. <clears throat> Alright, so we're going. Let's just keep exploring. Hmm. I forgot this game ran 60 frames. Like, I've been playing a lot of games that are slow. <laughs> it's kind of surprised when I started. I was like, oh man, I forgot how smooth this was. Okay, we got a spot we can go to over here, or. Let's do a few more things really quick, and then we'll head that way. Reloading! Oh, what is this? Hey, what? Oh, this is the. Oh, nice. This is a thing where you can upgrade. I'm pretty sure that's what you need to upgrade your overall health amounts. Like you can use it to upgrade certain things as well, like the armor and everything. Uh, I could be wrong though. Alright, let's get going. See if they follow me. Looks like they are. We all have to go together, I'm pretty sure. Yeah, all players must be near in order to travel. Okay, nice. There's apparently new stories and new new bosses in here too. New events, new quests. That's pretty awesome. I there's so much they've added since I last played. I'm just kind of like I'm taking it all in honestly. I need to get my outfit better though. I don't like the armor I've been using. That's some of that like first year kind of armor. <laughs> uh leave dungeon. No, I'm good. Soundtrack is very, uh, very chill, you know? Oh, I do have a few. Hold on. I got one point. You can kind of see all the stuff you can unlock. Mind's eye, handling. Uh, I'm just going to hang on to it for now. Now entering. Okay. A little different area. Stop off. Oh, corrosion. Oh my, what the world? What's that? Unless that was something that was... Oh god, I don't know this at all. That's shock ability. I'll kill that thing, please. Nice, nice. I spent the early part of my afternoon reading Dr. Seuss books to my little girl. I'm getting better! How now, brown cow, baby? All knows Dr. Seuss, he had some bars, for sure. <laughs> yeah, I've said that before, but he is like... Every time I read it, I'm just like amazed. That corrosion stays on you. I could use an item and get rid of it, but... I mean, it doesn't really, really seem that, that pressing, you know? Oh dear. Why is this person... 
I don't want to walk in there because it looks like you're going to get corrosion. Oh, God. Where'd the other person go? Oh, the person's way over there. Uh, way uh, on the other side, behind us. I'm going to go up this way and just see. I don't know what they're doing back there, but they are by themselves. Something's behind me. I might change up my gun. You know, I, if I get a new weapon from any of these new bosses, I may start swapping out. I don't want to get rid of this SMG for a long time. Oh, you got I'm just so happy they put more stuff in this game because I felt like it definitely has a really... Oh, hold on. Hold on. I'm coming. Hello, fam. Nice, another trait point. Let's get it. I probably should have put on a harder difficulty. Yeah, hold on. Should I run back to see where this guy went? Let me go. Let me go help. I don't want anybody to be left alone. Uh, and it sounds like I hear a lot of like things happening behind me. A lot of chests in here, though. That's all I know. I try to thoroughly run through each area, but sometimes you just miss stuff, you know? You can't help it. There could be a thing, like, hidden in here that you're never gonna find if you don't, uh, explore to the fullest extent, you know? Adrenaline. Yeah, I'm gonna see what's back here. All the guy's just kinda doing his own thing as well, so... Ooh, shit, hold on. Oh, God. Time to go. That's a lot of enemies, guys. Oh, I'm headed back to them. I'm not about to get jumped. If I stop right now, <laughs> it could be bad. That's them. Wait a minute, that's them? That's a cool cool armor. I thought they were enemy for a minute. Glowing green like that? This thing okay. Nothing. All right. I'm gonna try to interact with everything I can find. Oh my god. Big guy! Nice. Did they explode or anything? I think we're good. I love doing that. All right, checkpoint. Let's get it. Oh, hold on. I'm not going to get it yet. Collect some things first, shall we? Well, I'll help them out. Hold on, they must be doing something back there. I can't go to the little thing yet until they're with me, so I'm gonna I might as well go go back to them and help out. If needed. I haven't used this yet. Let me help them out a little bit. Oh, they don't even need it. Never mind. The one guy did, but he's not next to me. Oh, God. Yo, that's crazy. What in the world? Or forging iron, nice. Sound effects in this game are really well done, I feel like. Oh my god. Another one. Better back up. Top down there. Stuck on something. Let's go 
baby. Oh, I'm out of bullets. Thing, man. Uh, all right. We're all just kind of spread out. I'm going to the shrine. I really need to get some more ammo. And just overall, just get more stuff. And I don't know if you unlock stuff by going to the shrines or not. Like, I don't know if it, like, puts it on the map where you can fast travel later on or not. I cannot remember how it actually works. I'm going to see if they come to me. Cause I like don't have any way to do anything. Well, I got a little bit more ammo. We'll, we'll see if they come here or not. It's not safe killing nearby enemies. Is it because of this thing? Hmm. Maybe you can't do that yet until. Let's just go further. I. You know what? I just realized I can just do this. There's some ammo. I. I keep forgetting I have these little shortcut items already put on here. It's just been so long since I played it, I forgot about it. Those were clutch when you fight, like, big bosses that, uh, take a lot of damage. Especially, like, the last fight of the game. It's cool that as they pick up stuff, I'm also getting most of it. It feels like, at least. I don't know where we're going, but, uh... We've been through every spot in this area, except the upper left, maybe? A little bit to the left on the other side. Let's just keep going down, I guess. Oh, you can break those. I didn't know that. Anything back here, I wonder? No, it's another area. Man, I, I keep- they look just like the, uh, the actual enemies down here. That's funny. Alright, nice. Thanks, Paul. Bags full. Bags full of everything. What is this? Long- oh, that's, that's ammo. Okay. Yeah, I forgot what it even looks like. Now, hold on. Acid clean key. Inventory. Okay, so this is something you actually need. Alright. Acid clean key? I'm guessing this is going to be the thing. It works. Nice! Okay. Somebody else has joined the game. Do we have to kill this thing? Alright guys, so I went in that whole entire area and it there wasn't much to it, so there was like a little area you could, uh, like a checkpoint up top. But I, I came back to this main little section because there's just so much to, uh, check out. And the boss symbol is going south, so I'm gonna head towards that because I really wanna fight something. Um, but, yeah, so I went in there and there was like one key. And there's like five or six different things you can unlock at the end, but you have to pick which thing you use that key for. I didn't know if there was keys or not, but you guys left so we could figure it out. Uh, but I just wound up saying, you know what, I'm just going to run back out here and follow the boss icon with the skull on the minimap and go south over here. So, I want to fight something. It might be a new boss, might be an old one, I really don't know yet. All those have a lot of fun with this, and there's a lot to take in. Plus, I'm also... They added some puzzles, too, I didn't know about. It might have been when I was just in, I just didn't realize it. So... Getting my bearings, though. It's kind of a nice little return to this game. I had a lot of fun with it back in 2019. And, uh, this has been no exception. Hold on, what? Look at the range on this thing. Alright, hopefully these guys are good. <laughs> so far, they got some pretty cool builds. This one guy is like a flaming sword, so... Oh, yeah, the boss symbol is down here, so... Maybe should have just went here originally. I was kind of running around exploring. All right, here we go. 
All right, uh, I followed the boss icon and it led me actually back out that area I was currently in during the last little section. And did I already use this? Well, checkpoint. Might as well, right? Get that re replenish of ammo and everything. All right, nice. Yeah, I wanted to go back to the boss icon because it says it's over here. Uh, looks like it's still going south. Now entering. Butcher's, oh, the butcher. I have a bad feeling about this area, guys. There's no, like, many enemies or anything. We need to be stealthy here. This is that guy. Okay, I remember fighting something that's like the butcher in the original game. I don't know. Oh, is he like a regular enemy now or something? Oh, my God. We, we are just... Don't you shoot. I kind of want to just stir up the, the, like the beehive over here, you know? This is kind of cool. I don't remember this at all in the original, because if you'd come in here, you'd get like a cutscene originally. At least I'm pretty sure that was the case. But yeah, the the other section I was in with the other two guys, you it was just like a huge maze, and also at the very, very tip top, there was like a... It was like a crystal you could pray at or whatever, and then... What is this? What? Hiding spots? What? I guess I'll hop in this one. This is strange, man. What is going on? Are we gonna ambush this fool or something? What's going on here? What is the, what is the purpose here? I feel like... Wait, what? what's just happening? I've never seen this before. Uh, so it just faded to black and now we're here? Are we making a move? Or... Oh my god. This is different, man. Oh my goodness. Oh, let me get my health thing, uh... Oh my god, the damage! Gotta jump right at the right time, fellas. This is crazy. We got four phases? Oh god! But I can, I'm gonna use this to kill and then I'll run up. I'll pop an ammo thing. Oh my god. Oh, I was not trying to do that. Hold on. What is this? Is this a reasonable game? It's like you can take damage still. They're wounded, but... I'm gonna die. Oh my god. I'm done. Oh my god, this is crazy. That's that spin attack. Get out of there, dude. Oh, he's, he's surviving. No, he's not. He's dead now. Y'all better get out of there, man. Oh, hurry up. This thing is tanky. Oh, I jumped into it.
shouldn't be something you get hit by if you just stay far back enough. Ready now, he's coming at me. They better be shooting him. What? Oh, I'm out of health. Oh my god. I gotta do this. Oh my god. And we need to hurry up and take this pool down. Come on, ammo. Okay, yeah, we should get him here. There's no reason we should not kill him right here. Come on, melt him. Nice, let's get it, baby. That was sick. That was really awesome. So, that was, so the original, yeah. Let's check this. Uh, materials? Yeah, it's this thing. New powerful weapon, okay. That was so awesome. I didn't know what was gonna happen here. Emote, um, oh, there's emotes in this game now? Or was there always emotes? That, I feel like the whole entire video is me not realizing what was in the original game and what's new, except for like the new modes and everything. This was obviously brand new, but like the little items here and there. The ping system, the emotes, I don't... Maybe I didn't use those things, I don't know. I liked how we started this, though. That was awesome. Can we just leave now, or what? So we killed him. Maybe there's stuff in here we can get. Hold on. Yeah, I gotta say, that was a very cool way to do the fight. I wouldn't have known. So, here's what I'm guessing. I feel like you can fight him upstairs, and it'll be kind of like the original, or you can do the thing I did with them, which might have even been an original thing, I don't remember, uh, but I feel like that was new. And fighting him in there was a lot easier because you can see what he's doing, because it's a big open area. Is there anything over here? Looks like this all this entire area was is just the boss. All right, let's head back. I'm gonna get back to the nearest little checkpoint thing. I might stop after that though, but uh, again, if you guys wanna know more about this, just click the link and ship at the very, very top of the description. And thanks again, Perfect World, for sponsoring this video. It really was awesome to kind of return to this. And if you guys would like more, I'll kind of see how the video does. If we hit like 10,000 likes, I may do a part two. Uh, I'm just having fun playing it. I'll, I'll probably wind up playing it regardless, but I, uh, as far as making videos, I kind of leave it up to you guys. Yeah, that was that was pretty sweet. Being able to being able to just kind of experience it in a different light. It did seem a lot harder. I remember the first time I fought that guy was it was not it was that easy. I felt like or it was like it was easy originally, but now it's like a lot tougher. This person already left. I don't know. I'm gonna go back here and head back to the main ward. Ward 13. See what I I'm gonna see what that actual item gives me. I'm gonna check out and see if there's anything yeah. new we can get from. Fine. Let's have a look. Let's see, swarm. That's something else. Okay, that's I can craft this. Swarm tusk. This is the thing. So this is something you get, yeah. Hammerheads up. This is a brand new thing. Brand new weapon. Then we got this as well. Uh might as well. Yeah, good. Wait, let me what see if now? I can buy anything new. Yeah, better be worth what you're Nothing done there. here. Okay. What I could do, though, I got some of those crystals. You come over here, and then you interact with this person on the bottom. I don't remember how many of these things it requires for you to actually be able to upgrade your health. I could be wrong, though. Oh, it's this person. Never mind. The portent returns. Have you anything of the root for me? Uh, this let's see what we got. Help. Dragon Shard, yep. See that, the two of those, uh... Sim, let me call them Sims. Nice, Friend now I have eight. Well, I have ten total. That's a lot. Awesome. 
Welp, on that note, guys, I love you all. You're the best audience ever. I can't thank you enough. I really want this guy's, like, flaming sword or whatever that is. A flaming melee weapon he has. But uh, you guys are awesome. If you want more of this game, you know what to do. And I'll talk to you guys on the flip side. Take it easy, guys.